Hello, I'm Stuart Skelton and I am singing the role of Peter Grimes in the new production of Peter Grimes at the New National Theatre of Tokyo, opening on October the 2nd. Please come along and enjoy uh, the opera that we're going to put on for you and I know that it will be a theatre experience and an opera experience that you will not forget. So, arigatou uh, gozaimasu. Peter Grimes, the character, the role, the opera has been very kind to my career. Um, it has taken me to some wonderful places. It has brought me to Japan. Um, but I think one of the things that I like most about the character of Peter is that although he is a character that he is, <clears throat> he's very hard to find sympathy for. He's a character that is oftentimes in the opera not very nice to people. But I think one of the interesting parts and one of the parts of the character I like most is finding those very small places in the character where we can feel some sympathy or empathy with Peter. It's not. It's not different at all. Um, because one, I think people think of Wagner operas as being only all of all loud all the time, and it's not. Um, Wagner gives singers lots of opportunity to sing beautifully, and to sing a beautiful line, and to sing quietly, and to portray character. Um, Peter Grimes is the same. Benjamin Britten is the same. Particularly Peter Grimes. There are some places in Peter Grimes where it's. It is very powerful, very physically involved singing in the same way of we, as that we think of Wagnerian singing. But there are lots of times in Peter Grimes where, and in Britain, where you get to, to make very, very quiet, very beautiful sounds, the same way you do in Wagner. I think the, there are lots of similarities um, that when one sings Wagner and when one sings Britain, you need to pay attention to every word the text is very important and the way that the text and the music combine and those things are true of both Wagner and Britain and I think in a lot of ways they are very very similar. I think the most important things for this opera for newcomers particularly for a Japanese audience uh, is that the opera takes place in a small fishing village and I think from what I understand of Japanese geography, Japan is also a country, an island that is very much reliant on uh, its or has been reliant uh, on its fishing industry and small villages uh, all over the island. The rehearsal process is always the fun part. Um, you get to work with new colleagues, uh, although in my case, a lot of the, my Western colleagues I've worked with before, but of course I've never worked with any of my Japanese colleagues before now. Um, and that's always exciting to watch um, how the whole process comes together from the first day where we don't know anybody to that rehearsal process where we all come together and we work towards making the, sh making the opera, making the show, making each performance as exciting as we can.